Mrs. Miller here, and I'm going to read to you the book, And Then Come Summer, by Tom Brenner, illustrated by K Jamie Kim. <laughs> Look at this little dog with the ice cream cone. When the days stretch out like a slow yawn, and leaves in grassy sparkle with dew, and the cheerful faces of Johnny jump ups, jump up. Then throw on flip flops and breathe the sweet air when bumblebees bumble around the flowers and wobblers flip from tree to tree and the air thrums with the sound of lawnmowers. Then pump up your bike tires, dig out your helmet, and raise your seat. My, how you've grown! When the last class project is finished, and your cubby is cleared of cookie crumbs and eraser bits, and the end of the year hugs have been given. Then swap out backpacks and notebooks for pitchers and cups. They need a lemonade stand. When daylight pushes back bedtimes and crickets crick crick in the evening air and bugs as big as thumbs bang against the windows, then play hide and seek until darkness wins. When stores unfold their stars and stripes and flags wave from porches and cars and the whole town seems wrapped in bunting, then Dress up your bikes and pedal to the parade. When bands march by, left, right, left, right, and all manner of floats float past, and scouts and pioneers toss candy. Then grab your blanket and watch the night explode in colorful sprays. When every day is like a Saturday and porches and lawns and sidewalks are playgrounds and a familiar jingle interrupts the game, then race to be first in line. Almond fudge, please. Ooh, they're getting ice cream. When the dog days of summer roll around and it's so hot you're practically panting and not even the sprinklers provide relief, then it's time to head to the lake or Near me, we go to the ocean. Roll down the window and smell the hot, dry grass. Shout your favorite song at birds swooping across the fields and ask for the millionth time, are we there yet? When the familiar sign appears at last and the silver lake winks through the trees and old friend's friend to greet you, Lake Sunnyside. Then scramble out of your car, dash down to the beach, and swim till the sun is low and your lips are blue. And when dinner is over and stories have been told and your fingers are sticky with marshmallow and chocolate and the fire burns down to glimmering coals, then snuggle into your sleeping bag and plan tomorrow's adventure. The end.